Dylan Harmon was a teacher at the local middle school. His wife, Connie, worked from home selling makeup products on the internet. Everything was going well for the Harmon family until one cold winter day. Dylan's school gets called off early because there's this big winter storm coming in. So Dylan gets home at noon instead of five, and there's Connie, his wife, and there's Evan Walker, her old high school boyfriend, and they're, you know, together. Police say Dylan went to the closet and grabbed a gun from the wooden box they kept it in. He returned to the bedroom and fatally shot the lovers before turning the gun on himself. The house and everything in it were put up for auction and were purchased by this woman, Sarah Weaver. But perhaps the house wasn't that vacated after all. It started almost as soon as I moved in. I, there was like screams and there's cries and these weird cold spots when I walk through the hall and I just wanted to stop. Over the next 24 hours, we will use brand new, state-of-the-art cameras designed specifically to capture and record spectral energy. Together with paranormal psychic medium Roberta Delaney, we will get to the bottom of the haunting of Harmon House. The house is set up. We have all of our ghost detecting cameras set up in the main areas. I decided to try to communicate with the spirits. Hello? There are any spirits in here? Give us a sign. Whoa! Did you feel that? Feel what? It was, it was right here. It was like... It was like a whoosh! It was like a whoosh right here! I felt it. I felt a whoosh! It was, it was right here and I felt... It was like... It was just like whoosh! Aaron said he felt a whoosh. I didn't feel a whoosh. I feel everything. Are you f***ing serious? It was definitely a whoosh. I felt it came right by my leg. It was like... It was like whoosh! Nobody touched him. He's making it up. Did anybody touch him? Not that I know of. Hey guys, it's Saturday night. Let's drive out to Stotson and bother the ghosts. Are there any spirits in here? I demand you make yourselves known. Hey. 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 I repeat, spirits, show yourselves. These are holes, right? Okay. Yeah. You know, I realize you're trying and that it's important. So maybe we all get together and in an attempt to break the ice, maybe. Shut the f up, Evan. Stuff with Connie and I isn't that great. I did kill her and Evan, and we're stuck in this house together forever. So that's awkward. Hello? For the love of Christ. Just ignore them. I can't. It's bad enough that I'm stuck in this house with Dylan and you, and I gotta keep listening to these dickheads. I understand. Oh, so I hurt your feelings? Great. You don't want me here. I get it. There are any spirits down here? You know what? Why don't you leave? That's a great idea. Oh, wait, you can't. Because we're stuck in this f***ing haunted house for all eternity. And every time I look at you, stranger, you're like, Oh, what's the matter? Oh, I want to talk about it. I care for you so much. <sighs> So you're mad at me because I care about you? Oh. My. God! Did you hear that? I think so. It sounded like, like angry voices. Whoa! Whoa! What was that? Did you get that? We definitely had a close encounter in the basement. I mean, I... I felt this whoosh, and then, and then the angry voices, never. In all of my ghost hunting experience, have I ever been more sure that they're spirits and that they're angry that we're here. So, to show them that we're serious and to keep Sarah safe, tomorrow morning, we're gonna perform an exorcism. Since this is where the murder happened, this is where we need to perform the exorcism. We'll need a, a powerful totem to trap them in. Uh, something that was really important to them. Okay. 
What's this all about? <laughs> this? This is an exorcism. Come on in and have a seat. This should be really good. What is that? This is the box that held the gun. It's perfect. Open the lid. We're gonna use this box to trap the evil spirit. Let the exorcism begin. <laughs> You've gotta be kidding me. No. Another fine mess I've gotten into. Honey, look, I, I'm sorry. Hey, Kai said you guys want to do a jigsaw. Did you get that? The spirits are trapped and they're never coming back. Hopefully, Sarah can now rest a little easier knowing that we've helped her out. I'm Aaron Thornburg, signing off. And cut. Great job, guys. Thank you. I can't wait to see the footage.